Can I get a second passport? I am sure many of you have this question. To know the answer, please watch this video till the end. Hi friends, I am Paresh Karya, CEO of Equest Advisors, an immigration advisory firm based on Mumbai and having Pan India presence. We have been getting this question from all over the country, right from Punjab to Kerala and Gujarat to Kolkata. To get the answer, let us look at the basics first. What is citizenship? A citizenship is a legal status that a person belongs to a particular country. By a virtue of the status, he is entitled to certain rights and benefits as well as obligations under the constitution of that country. A passport, on the other hand, is a travel document issued by the government to its citizens to enable them to travel globally. It also serves as a proof of citizenship. In order to get a second passport, you need to take up citizenship of that other country in addition to your home country. And with that, you get benefits in both these countries like right to passport, right to travel, to stay there, work there, study there and so on. One of the biggest benefits of a second passport is that you can travel visa free to all the countries that passport is entitled to. For example, with a British or an American passport, you can travel visa free to 186 countries. With a Portuguese passport, you can travel to 187 countries like US, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, UK and the whole of Europe. Now coming back to our main question. Can an Indian citizen get a second passport? The answer is clearly no. The Indian constitution does not allow its citizens to take foreign citizenship while being a citizen of India. So once you take up a foreign citizenship, you will automatically lose Indian citizenship. Not only that, you are also supposed to surrender the Indian passport to the nearest embassy or mission. Else there is a penalty. I am sure many of you would be interested in taking up foreign citizenship, but would also like to enjoy benefits in India. Now how can you do that? Well, the government of India allows you to do that through a special status called OC Citizen of India or OCI for short. Now what is OCI? What are its benefits and how one can become an OCI? To know this, kindly watch our next. Well friends, I hope you like this video and if you found it useful, please like it, share it and comment on it. I would also request you to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can get notification for our forthcoming videos. Thank you.